one reason why we have a hard time sometimes sticking to our plan. You know how we have the plan, we do the prep, and then like Wednesday comes and we're not sticking to it anymore. And like, then you talk to someone a week later and you explain to them, well, I was doing this thing, it was working really well, and then this happened. One reason that I found that we have a hard time sticking to our plan, I was just having a conversation with a client about this the other day. She was telling me she's supposed to be from her doctor eat, eating less sugar and she's not eating less sugar. She's eating the sugar and then she feels guilty about it and then she eats more sugar. And I was like, okay, well tell me about your plan. And she was like, yeah, well, I'm supposed to eat less sugar. And I'm like, but what is the actual plan? She's like, well, actually maybe that's the problem. It is the problem. We cannot follow a plan if we don't have one. And if we're not really clear on it, it gives our brain way too much vague, way too much gray to give us even more excuses and reasons not to follow it. And if we're just saying things like eat less sugar, that could mean anything. That can mean one piece of chocolate. It can mean a chocolate bar. Moral of the story here, if you are someone who's struggling with consistency or sticking to your plan, make sure you have a very, very clear one. And I mean, what exactly you want to do, where you want to do it, when you want to be doing it, and for how long. It'll be a whole lot easier to stick to it if you have those things.